What's going on, everybody? This is Fully Bay. And this is Oscar from Level Base Game. And we are playing the Amnesia Collection. Right here, we're starting with The Dark Descent. Now, in the in spirit of Halloween, we decided to go with a, a little bit of a horror game. Now, me personally, I had absolutely zero knowledge of the Amnesia Collection. And since it was actually free on PlayStation Store, you know, downloaded for free. So we figured, hey, why not? Yeah, me neither. I haven't even played this at all. I have no idea about it. Um, I didn't know it was released on PC in 2010. And then I think free DLC with Justine. And uh, that was released in April of 2011. And then the last part, uh, March for Pigs was released in 2013, September 2013. So all, all the DLC was free? Uh, no, just Justine. Oh, just okay, just the um, okay. Much for Pegasus, but actually some separate uh, DLC. Ah, okay. All right. Now we had a, a little bit of a play session earlier. You know, we're just to get familiar with the game, and we got—I want to say we got that far, but we, you know, nothing really happened. So we're pretty much going to pick up from where we where we left off last. And I believe, sort of, to give a little bit of a a brief. Uh, Summary for those of you who haven't played Amnesia, I believe that the main character's name is Daniel. Right, uh, yeah. and, and um. after that, it's just he's he's going crazy or he's gone crazy. He doesn't know where he is, or he probably does know where he is. But we need to look for a library. I want to say. I remember. <laughs> well, looks like we'll figure it out now. But seeing, yeah. Continue previous play absolutely. So the good thing about this is since we're both pretty much playing it for the first time, our reactions will be legitimate. This is not, you know, we does not rehearse, this is not, you know, footage that we caught ahead of time. So if you hear me scream like a girl, I legitimately apologize. <laughs> it's not it's, it's not my intention because these type of games Although I love horror games, I freaking hate jump scares. And I feel like a lot of games nowadays, they're all about jump scares rather than having a good sort of survival horror experience. But then again, that's just me. All right. I think that's something atmosphere. Yeah. I mean, I, I do believe the atmosphere does have a lot to do with it. And this game really does seem to have that atmosphere. All right. What's this right here? I'm trying to get my bearings with the, with the controls again. 16th Here we May, go. 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. It seems like in these type of games, there's always that one individual who really documents everything. <laughs> I'm talking about, see, see all these, pa really see all these yeah, there's, there's always that one guy, you know, everybody, uh, everybody calls him crazy, but then something goes down and, you know, we have all this backstory to help us with whatever we're trying to do. Okay, let's see. See notes. Daniel's note to self. Chemical relocation. Okay. I forgot how you look for the objectives. If that's even a thing. I don't think it will Hmm. Okay, let's see here. There's that room. With that puzzle in it. Oh, that's right, yes. See what this says. 17th of May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need 
to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if See? I linger. They need to document it. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Hmm. <laughs> And it's interesting that it has no, no mini map. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, yeah. But then again, it, it was what you said. What year? What year you say it was? Twenty ten. Uh, no, eighteen. No, when the game was originally released. Oh, twenty ten. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe that was normal. Not to have a HUD, or not to have some oh, sort no, of. To have to have a HUD. Going in circles. Yeah, you went there already. All right. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. Okay. Wait a minute. No, no, you ain't going there. Okay. Mm -hmm. I know you heard that. Yeah, I definitely heard that. Oh, Jesus Christ. Now, you think there's going to be any jump scares, or you don't think that that's that type of game? Yeah, we wanted to. Okay. And just us being there with some of the wrong ones. Fragile but, but not breakable by hand. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. It's just the wind. It's just drafty in there. Oh, look at Something's about to go down because you saw the save icon towards the bottom right. <laughs> That's probably a clue. Oh god damn it. No, oh, hold on. No. Oh yes. Oh, another letter. Uh oh. <laughs> What's happening? What's happening? 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. It almost seems like whatever he's reading, he's living. 
It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted, the voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. Grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Yeah, it's kind of telling us where we need to go, so... We need to go in here. Okay. Who, who the hell is playing that damn piano? Uh-oh. Looks like we're about to find out. The castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Can you grab those? No, right. those I can't grab. Alright. Hmm. Boo, yeah, son. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Uh-oh. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, Daniel. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I'm just destroying a house, a perfectly good house. I don't need that. There we go. Okay. What are the odds? Wait a minute, I hear something. Is it coming from in Okay, it's not coming from this room. Can you light those up? No. The... these? Oh, you can. Oh. There you go. I feel like you're wasting them now. No, you're right. Random book. And you 
hear something clinging. I did another one. Turn around. Turn, turn around. Turn around. Go back. Go back? Did the, the bookshelf, but I go back. That bookshelf right there. Oh, right I see. Oh, you're right. So this is obviously is a puzzle. And the sh Not here. So it was just those two? Okay, so door still locked. I mean, they look. Door still locked, which means I can still. Oh. There we go. A key. That's what we're supposed to be looking for the wine cellar key. Something just happened. Okay, nothing in there. I don't read as well as them, so I'll just put that away. Yeah. You don't have that, that accent? Yeah, I don't have that British accent. Alright, nothing in there. Oh, come on now, really? <sighs> oh, okay. you're back. Uh, yeah, we're back. Uh, so this door should be locked. Okay. And now this is... Whatever that is. Okay, I was in here. So now we really gotta backtrack. You know what? <sighs> What's that? You know, this is, this is really not funny. Like, I hear footsteps, I hear... The piano again. Jesus. Whoa. Oh, come on now. So, so it looks like I can't touch this stuff. That's blocked. I can't go down that way. Legs ready. Oh, there we go. Of course, it won't budge. All right, so we have to go to the wine cellar. Use the key on the door. Oh, I remember this is uh, 2010, so they did things differently back then. You actually have to use the key. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. See, back then, things were more simpler back then, you know? There's a small part of me that wants to just be in the dark and just to see what would happen. Where did the Baron go? 
Who cares? He left nothing up wine to last us a lifetime. Or at least until tomorrow. <laughs> Safe to say we won't go down there. Whoa, 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 what? The enemy is nearby, what? If. If. <laughs> oh man, he's near. Definitely near. Oh man, that's what. That's what I, I, that's why I always hated about these old homes. Like, you can hear everybody <laughs> literally walking inside the entire house. And you're settling. Did you just settling. Settling. Yeah. Oh, there he is. There he is. I'm in the dark. I'm in the dark. You don't see me. You don't see me. Oh, man. You know what? I, I, I pooped myself a little. I, I'm going to be honest. That's all you gotta do, just hide in the dark? I guess I am. I'm gonna hit him with this rock. Just a hallucination, or you think he was really standing there? It's a ghost. All right, what am I supposed to be looking for? Yeah, I don't even know. What's this? Is close to. Oh, man, I am freaking out right now. All right, you know what? If I close this door. Sorry. Don't do it. No, he, he, he. Oh fuck. It's too small. Stay in the light. Stay in the light. I can't see anything. Oh my god. gonna have to. Shit, yeah, I'm gonna have to. I can't even control. Alright, stay in the light. Stay in the light. I'm in the light. Are you serious? Yeah, like I'm having difficulty moving.
Ooh. Of course I want to be able to use the hammer. Uh-huh, uh-huh, like okay. eight hammers or anything. And I can't pick up one. Alright, there was a letter here. I got it. Contains a full roll. Yes. Yes. <sighs> Shit, and he has chains. <laughs> you like a haunted house. Yeah. Dude, straight beating people up. Oh boy. What's happening? Oh, it feels like my chest is going to burst. Oh. My God, Wilhelm, do something! Except you. we're not getting out of here. How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! <laughs> And I think with that being said, this is going to be where we cut our let's play. Oh man. Yeah. This is this is definitely something. This is definitely definitely something. We'll definitely uh be able to continue this up later. You know, uh Oof. I I literally, I, 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 literally, I literally got goosebumps a little. It's freaking me out a little. I'm not I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Oof. All right, for level based gaming, right. I I'm Phil. And then Oscar. And uh, we'll probably try to do a little bit more uh, Let's Play within the next couple more weeks. Um, hit the subscribe button below, and uh, we'll talk to you guys soon. Later. Later. Yeah.